Omaha's weather leader, Chief Meteorologist Bill Ranby with your accurate weather now forecast. It is Ranby Factor time. This evening gets a Ranby Factor of 10. We almost never do that, but that's what we have right now. A spectacular evening for being and working outside so far. The high temperature has been 70, which is exactly average. And I want to show you the low temperature 35 this morning. Wow. Really cooled off. 24 though is the record low temperature. No precipitation today. None this month. So dry back in September. This is a, a brutal harvest season with how dry it is out there. And we still have a little bit of weed pollen in the air, a medium count of that, and the air quality is just so so. Now the sky is kind of hazy, but that's because of smoke from western wildfires, and that is aloft, so we're not smelling the smoke at the surface. Boy, that looks beautiful. That's the Omaha Riverfront and the Heartland of America Park from our camera at the Embassy Suites. Downtown on 10th Street, 70 calm winds, 2.36. Wow. 71 in Fremont, Plattsmouth, 70. Harlan, Denison, Atlantic, Carroll, Winds, Kalman, Omaha, Plattsmouth, Nebraska City, Atlantic, Red Oak, Super Doppler 7 radar, nothing. The satellite pictures show a couple of clouds west of us, and you see this is picking up uh, by radars outstate that it looks like there's some precipitation there. Uh, there isn't anything reaching the ground, but maybe a couple sprinkles in the clouds southwest of the Omaha Metro. This is Milton. You've heard about it, that they're preparing in Florida for this hurricane, which is currently a Category 5, but it's small, and the eye is just this tiny little dot here, but super intense. It's likely that it may weaken a bit, but also spread out and become larger before it hits Florida, which right now looks like maybe Wednesday night as the time frame. Here this evening, mostly clear skies. Tomorrow morning, mostly sunny skies. Tomorrow afternoon, another beautiful day. And if the winds stay under 10 miles an hour, it might be one of the top 10 days of the year. I'm getting a lot of reports of northern lights tonight in England and Scandinavia, so it's possible we could see some of that tonight. Mostly clear skies, worth looking if you're in a dark area and have a view to the north. Look at Tuesday, a super Tuesday. Sunny skies, light winds, another great day to be outside. Warms up a bit on Wednesday, Thursday and Friday. I have impact icons as I think we have more of a south breeze and that probably creates a high fire danger. So we'll have to watch that closely. Temperatures down a little bit as we go later this weekend, early next week. All right, but a top 10 day. Oh, our sixth top 10 day of the year. Ah. And still time to enjoy it here this evening. Love that. Enough.